guys welcome back to another video today i want to share with you guys a little shopping haul uh if you've watched some of my previous videos you would have known that i traveled to the states a few weeks ago and while i was there i was able to take advantage of some shopping mainly i feel like i did a lot of target shopping because we don't have a target out here and also a few other stores that we may or may not have, but they're probably just not close to me here in Puerto Rico. So, anywho, if you're interested, I would love to make this a try-on haul. So, I'm going to try to try these on and, like, insert pictures or, like, a small video alongside of just showing you the pieces. But it's a little mixture, stuff for me. I think there's stuff for the kids. And, like, one or two house items as well so if you're interested on what i picked up when i was traveling in the u.s then keep watching okay so i have everything in this little reusable bag as part of the shopping haul actually i picked up this reusable tote it says just the essentials on it um at the target bullseye dollar spot section they were a dollar i got this green one and this little pink little checkered print style um i feel like a lot of places are not giving out bags anymore you have to like bring in your own reusable bags and puerto rico is one of the places where they don't really give you shopping bags at most places so this one's pretty big i kind of love the color love that it has like a large strap and it was only one dollar so i picked up two of them i got this pink one and then this green one here so that's like the first item that i got let's see what do i've got i guess i'll stick with like the random things that aren't clothes um to be kind of consistent with what i'm showing you guys next i picked up these little hand towels also from the bullseye section at target um so if you like them they should be available at your local target but this one has a little happy halloween pumpkin stitched on it and then it came with a second one that just has like a repeated pattern of different uh, jack-o-lanterns in a few different colors which i love and i think it's super cute and festive one thing is i moved to puerto rico one year ago like yesterday was my one year anniversary i was super pregnant in the process of trying to move in and we were hit by a hurricane last fall time so there was no fall season i mean there is no fall season in puerto rico anyway it's always hot here but i didn't get to like do any de like decorating or anything like that so i'm trying to do a little more of that this year now that we're officially settled in i'm not pregnant anymore there are no hurricanes god willing in the foreseeable future so picked up those tea towels for that i also got this pack of packing cubes so now that we have a new addition to the family the packing cubes that i already have that i've raved about i feel like the last few vlogs have been like travel vlogs packing vlogs unpacking vlogs i've shown you guys my packing cubes and they honestly make a world of difference when you're traveling especially when you're traveling with like multiple people's things in your luggage keep everything nice and organized so i um got the ones i have currently off amazon and then i just found these for five bucks these two um large packing cubes at target and it's like this cute little fun pattern on it so this will be fun maybe i'll put the kids stuff in here just because it would be like a easy way to identify their things all right next i'm going to show you guys what i picked up for the kids so we have another trip coming up in november we're going to be going back to jersey for thanksgiving and i wanted to grab the kids some cute thanksgiving slash like colder weather clothes for our trip so i did a number at target um i love target's kids clothes we don't have a target here so i definitely took advantage while i was there so let's see uh for archie i got him this pair of sweat joggers just a simple little pair of orange sweatpants and i got this zipper hoodie 
to match with it a little matching set i thought it was super cute simple casual it'll be nice for the days where we're just kind of hanging out with family and the kids want to like play outside or something like that i think that's like a perfect outfit for that and what else did i get archie i also picked up this sweater for him in this really cute like dark green color it has a little astronaut head on the front and on the back it says my happy space i got it in a 4t so that it'll fit him oh no i'm lying i got it in a 5t so that it'll fit him a little oversized i love dressing them a little more on the like baggy cool oversized look um so i got that for him okay. last for rg i got him a cute set of pajamas long sleeve pajamas that he will definitely not use here in puerto rico because it's way too hot but for winter weather in jersey these are going to be perfect so it came with two pajama sets so it's this little pattern and then this one is so cute i love this one it's cream color with mini or with mickey mouse on it with the matching long pants um and then for Scotty, I actually got her a little Minnie Mouse pajama set. It's like the corresponding set to this one. Like that was the boy version. And then the little girl version is this little mini shirt, the front and the back. Well, the back and then the front. So cute with the little matching pants. So I got that for Scotty. And then it also came with this pattern, which I love. I'm really excited to put them in their little matching mickey mini pajamas so sweet and adorable also for scotty i got her this little sweater onesie i got it in the size 12 months she'll be 10 months when we're traveling so this will fit her kind of cute and oversized i think with some like cute little knee-high socks um it'll look really sweet on her it's kind of like this soft um a little bit on the like thicker side waffle long sleeve onesie i'm really excited to see what this is going to look like on her and then just to stay warm and kind of go out and about i got her this little mini set it's like this really cute beigey pink color so it comes with the sweatpants and the top top says mini on it it's just super cute and sweet i love the little mini mouse pattern and last for Scotty this might be her Thanksgiving outfit maybe it's this really cute kind of terry cloth material stretchy neck with a little bow and these little like bell sleeves also thinking about doing it with some of those really cute knee high thigh high socks sweet little bow I'm hoping that we could get some updated family photos done while we are visiting in New Jersey. So that might be like a contender outfit, um, either for Thanksgiving or for the photos or both, who knows. But love, love, love these little items from Target. All right, so last, I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up for myself. So I got a few things at Abercrombie. I picked up this kind of high neck, if you can tell. It's like a cropped sleeve, high neck, black bodysuit with a little bit of a rouging detail on the side. It's a very, very flattering bodysuit. Um, I really like the way it looks. I think it looks really pretty with like maybe your hair pulled back just because of the little mock neck detail that it has. Definitely considering this as one of the items that I pack with me for our trip. Also from Abercrombie, I think I just found my new favorite pair of jeans. I've actually worn these jeans several, several times already, but I put them in the bag um, so that I would remember to show them to you guys. So they're a little bit of a baggier fit. It's a straight leg, no distressing, and a medium wash. Love the way this fits my waist. Mind you, I'm eight months postpartum now. Still, my weight is kind of just like fluctuating. I was a size six. Now I'm fitting into a size four and all the pants that I had previously purchased fit me really, really baggy. So I got these in a four and they fit my waist so good. And also my butt looks nice. It's not like super saggy baggy because all of my size six pants are fitting me kind of saggy baggy in the butt. This one fits really nice. They're very flattering. I loved, love, love, love these jeans. I'm so happy that I got them. 
Let me see if I can find. They are the 90s relaxed jean in a high rise. I have a really short torso, so I try to, like, not that I try to stick away from a high rise, but I won't do, like, a very, very high rise pants because it'll just come, like, past my boobs because of how short my torso is. But these kind of just fit right at the perfect spot. Um, really, really, really love these jeans. They were a little bit pricey, but they are by far my favorite jean that I own right now. And they're the ones that fit me the best. All my other jeans, I'm just like right in between sizes. So they're not really that flattering. So these are my go-to jeans right now. All right, next up, I got this little random tank from Pink. I got it in this kind of like tan, it's like a very light, tan it's just a simple kind of creamy tank top it has a little bit of a ruching detail on the side here and i just think these tanks are just kind of really flattering i love the high neck right now and it's cropped so it fits perfectly inside any high waisted short or jean and next up from hollister i picked up this dress this might be my Thanksgiving dress. It is a long sleeve dress. You can wear it off the shoulder. You can wear it on, like up on your shoulders. I like this kind of like thicker band in the middle and it's actually like pants. What is it called? Like a romper. So it's not an actual short skirt, it's a romper. I love the fact that it's high sleeves, but like a shorter style dress. I plan on wearing it with my knee high boots that I have not worn in over a year, probably closer to two years now, right? I don't even know, it's been a minute. They're like my favorite knee high boots and I have not had a chance to wear them in forever because it's super hot and there's no reason for me to wear anything knee high. But I'm looking forward to potentially bringing that along for our Denver trip, for our anniversary, maybe like a fun little date night outfit, as well as potentially for like Thanksgiving time frame. I think it's going to be perfect. The fact that it has long sleeves and I could wear a knee-high boot and maybe some stockings to keep warm with the colder weather. I'm really excited for the dress. Okay, last few items. Now this isn't technically part of the US shopping per se. I ordered these pieces from White Fox Boutique, which is an Australian website, but they don't deliver to Puerto Rico. So when I ordered them, I had them sent over to my sister's house in the States. So I'm gonna include it in this haul because I didn't get to actually grab these pieces had I not traveled to the States. That's my spiel. Okay, first up is this little bodysuit thing. I think it's called the Serena play suit. It is too cute, y'all. They have it in two colors. I believe it's in black and in this color smoke. I think that's the name of this color. It's by White Fox Boutique Sarah's Day Collection. And it is this short kind of um, athleisure stretchy material. The back has a really low dip. I love this thing. Now, I will say I really wish I would have gotten it in a small. I got it in a medium because I felt like I was nervous about maybe not fitting in a small, but it does fit me a little bit loose. And so, like on the sleeves, like the sleeves, it's a little bit of extra material there that I feel like a small would have fit better. So just go true to size if you were to purchase this. I think they are currently out of stock, but they're doing a restock. I'm gonna show you guys what this looks like on. Love it, love it. So cute, really flattering, and just like cool mom on the go, running my errands. <laughs> Love this thing. And then you can kind of layer it, put like a sweatshirt over it, and just make it look like you're wearing like a sweater with some biker shorts. If you get hot, you can take your sweater off. Speaking of sweater, my last item is a sweater in the same like color way as the play suit. And I don't remember what this one is, but it's a pullover sweater. Also, White Fox Boutique from the Sarah's Day collection. Love this thing. It doesn't look like much here, but it's like this high neck. Uh, zips down to your chest, and it fits really oversized. And I don't know, I just love it. I think it's so cool. It gives such like 90s on-the-go mom vibes. 
um i just yeah i can't i don't know it doesn't look like anything but i'm going to show you it on and i just like the way it looks it just kind of looks cool again i live in puerto rico it doesn't get cold here but i am going to be traveling so i'm definitely taking this with me when we go to colorado and when we go to new jersey in the fall I'm really excited about those pieces especially because i just feel like they just look cool <laughs> All right, you guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this little haul. All this stuff is like fairly new. Like I just purchased it within the last few weeks. So if you're interested in any of the items and you want the link, let me know in the comments and I'll be happy to search it up and find those links for you guys. But that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you on the next one.